A couple years after college is when I began my lending career and have never looked back. I've got 25 years of ag lending experience and 21 of those with uh, Ag Texas. Ag Texas Farm Credit Services, 5004 North Loop 289 here in Lubbock, Texas. We have locations from Dumas all the way to Burleson, so we cover a lot of the state. Ag Texas Farm Credit provides uh, loans for operating, for equipment, land loans. We do rural, rural housing, we do recreational properties. Uh, second homes for folks, but uh, we definitely here in West Texas specialize in cotton farmers and their operations and their needs uh, to, to meet their dreams and their goals. Definitely the salt of the earth people, um, great long-term relationships, uh, seems natural and easy for us to, to, uh, to gel with them and discuss agriculture, their families, and we're, they're more than just a customer to us, they're family. I'm going to tell you, most of the time, um, they're, they're probably the most optimistic people. I mean, sure, we talk reality and not pie in the sky, but a lot of times they're, they're, they help me more than I help them. And uh, they, we all know the future is going to be bright. We're always going to go through ups and downs. And if anybody can deal with this current COVID situation, it's the West Texas farmer. They're used to ups and downs. And so they're, they're going to weather that storm and we're going we're to come through shining before too long. They both relate to agriculture, so it's, it's right up our alley. We finance agriculture and everything that it's about, and the Ag Museum's there to represent agriculture, both its past and its current and its future. I began the Ag Museum probably 15, 17 years ago. Uh, Mitchell Harris, our retired CEO, kind of got me involved along with Dan Taylor, and uh, ever since then we've done volunteer work, we donate uh, funds um, and uh, gift items uh, throughout the year. Ag Texas, uh, we love uh, using that Ag Museum for all types of events. We do our annual uh, customer appreciation event there. Uh, great, great location. If we have commodity meetings, we'll hold them there and have guest speakers come in. It's just, uh, it just makes sense to meet at that museum with all of its rich history of agriculture and our, our customer base. and. Uh, just an incredible environment. You can never have enough uh, help at the Ag Museum. As any museum, there's always a lot of stuff to do. It doesn't always have to be money out of your pocket or a check out of your checkbook. Donation of time means a lot. And if you want to get involved, learn a lot, have great fellowship, just call the Ag Museum, go up and visit the personnel, and they'll get you involved. I'm chairman of the membership committee and membership dues are very important to the success of the Ag Museum. We do have salaries to pay, overhead, electricity, air conditioning, and if we can, the more we can get that membership base to grow, the better we are as far as financially to stand, to stand the ups and downs of, of the fundraising that we do every year, uh, like the night at the museum. So I would ask folks to, to please consider to be a member. We've got level, levels of $50 up, we added a corporate membership this year. It's got a lot of neat benefits. If your company buys a corporate membership, they can have their, their own day at the Ag Museum. They can use the uh, conference room for private events and parties. So I highly encourage you to please become a member of the Ag Museum.